Hi, my name is Andrew Archibald, and I'm applying to be a charter member of the EU chapter at Florida Atlantic University in Boca Raton, Florida. My name is Andrew Archibald. I'm a freshman attending this university, majoring in management information systems and nonprofit management. So the qualities that prepare me for EU chapter leadership is my undying passion for helping people and um, prevent preventing of mental health issues. They're big, big, big topics to me. So helping out others is very meaningful to me personally. Um, I have a lot of responsibility <coughs> and hard work ethic caused by past job experience and being an orientation leader on my campus, which is helping new kids and new freshmen get adjusted to university life and being basically like kind of a big brother for them for new freshmen, for the several thousand that come every year. Um, in addition to this, I have um, very I have a large amount of responsibility. I know how to work with and um, adapt to different environments, different people, different kinds of people. So being able to kind of work with basically anybody is a really strong benefit, especially for a, media, a kind of organization like this. Um, the community that I'd like to create is a community. Okay, it's just, it's very simple. It's a community where people from all different backgrounds, be it religion, sex, social status, um, they can all come together under a common, um, a commonality or a common desire to change themselves or change the world or even just change one person's day. Um, no one would really be left out. I would not exclude anybody because that it's completely um, <laughs> it's completely counteractive to the overall message of this organization um, everybody would be able to help every member in the organization could personally email me call me talk to me about what issues they're going through and I would do everything I can to assist them personally or redirect them to somewhere that can better help them or assist them and this is really good for the um, community because mental health is really looked down upon as like a fake disease or like something that just people just don't care about really regardless of the fact that it claims several hundred thousand people's lives every year and it's very 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 harmful to the world and it's important that people are trained about it so <coughs> we can prevent death and this would impact Boca Raton, Florida as a whole because um, awareness on health, awareness on mental health would be a lot more prevalent and hopefully it would be a lot more mainstream and more people would do, would, um, would do more fundraising and activities to really prevent mental health issues and like suicide and anxiety. Um, lastly, for the community, I would hold bi-weekly or weekly meetings. That would be heavy or light meetings, which are a nod to uh, a previous campaign where we would use heavy meetings to cover instructional or educational things on more controversial issues, such as anxiety, depression, or pre preventing both of those. Um, it would be just a good education session. The light would be a group building or bonding experience where we would be able to showcase our own abilities or just meet new people and talk to people in the organization where we would go out, we can go out to like restaurants or anything like that. We can help talent shows or just cool group bonding activities. It would be able to kind of mix things up and make things not feel repetitive or monotonous. Um, I'm very passionate about music. I love music. I'm very, very good with music. Um, I'm actually gonna go practice because I have another show this week in addition to finals week, <coughs> which is gonna be a lot of fun for me. Um, I also love helping people, as mentioned. It's my true passion, it's my niche, and I love to do it with all of my heart. And cool things about my campus. So we were built on an old army base, and we have, well, first off, it's an army base. The second thing is we have a very large um, strip down the middle of our campus, which is shaded so we can avoid the Florida sun. That was actually an actual air landing strip for aircraft. Um, our third fact is that we are actually two miles from the beach, so you can go any day you want. Um, fourth, we have a army tunnel base, tunnel system under our base. It's not allowed to go under our school. It's not allowed to go to anymore due to headbestus. And then lastly, we have a couple of forests on campus, and one of them is actually called Narnia as a nod to um, the video. So thank you for watching this video and your consideration. I'm Andrew Archibald. Thank you again. Goodbye.